Hello, my name is Swiss Bianco. In this video I will talk about Grey Bar Adventure Piggyback. It's a typical neck knife or pocket knife. As we look on the packaging here we see Grey Bar Adventure Piggyback. On the back side we have some more information also about the Johnson Adventure Blades. On the bottom is the website kbar.com, it's made in China. Uh, they don't mention the steel that they did use. It's some cheaper variation of the Chinese steel. On the blade we have that etching there. And on the other side we have the number in China. It actually doesn't say kbar on the blade at all. Uh, so what is a bit different on this blade is that you can use that as a smaller skinner uh, for hunting and similar purpose we see on the top of the blade it has some serrations so you can get it in your hand like this. The handle is pretty good size for my bigger hand that is a surprisingly good handle. Uh, that is one of the reasons why I got it. We have a hollow grind, there is no blade length wasted, we have a pretty good guard there as well. So all in all the knife is not too bad itself. Uh, what I would change or what I gonna change is again also round off the edges of the handle. Uh, that is simply too sharp. Uh, it would be also possible to wrap it with a paracord, quite likely without uh, the inner strings in it, so you have even more more uh, handle. Then to the sheet, that's a simple injection molded affair. A small little little uh, lanyard hole there, so that's going to be tough for carry as a neck knife with that. Maybe that is more designed for keychains, who knows. Uh, the sheet is not going to last for a long time unfortunately. Uh, as usually with such sheets we have the problem that it is based on friction so it needs to go over the sharp edges of the knife to go in and lock and that is all what holds it in place. Uh, this one is at least not rattling so it's pretty pretty tight made but uh, prior you use that as a neck knife I would not uh, suggest it with that kind of sheet because it's gonna wear out really fast. So what I gonna do I'm gonna make me my own Kydex sheet just a simple variation uh, over folded uh, variation with, uh, with thinner Kydex and then first round off the handle a bit and then that knife gonna be really nice for use. This is not a collectible it's mainly a, a knife for using and if it uh, gets smaller on the blade by resharpening it's it's uh, done so that is how that is all in all it's relative compact still has a certain length so for many purposes that's going to be handy also as it is really flat uh, I think there is uh, some other variation on the K-Bar website as well uh, have a look for the for the latest information if there is a, also a black coated variation or something at least similar if I remember right there was a, a black one. So that much about K-Bar Adventure Piggyback Knife. 